start now hello we are going to study the area of a trapezium today trapezium is a special quadrilateral with only one pair of parallel sides so here we can see that side a and b are parallel to each other various versions of trapezium can be seen this way so these all are trapeziums and all of them have height h height is the perpendicular distance between these parallel sides our objective for today is to derive the formula for area of a trapezium we'll be doing that by two methods the first one here what we'll be doing is we'll be cutting a similar exactly same trapezium as this one and rotating it and placing it just adjacent to our previous trapezium this is how both the trapeziums look like now what do you observe both these figures together form a parallelogram the area of a parallelogram is given by base into height so the base in this scenario becomes a plus b and the height remains h for both the trapeziums so the area of the both these parallelograms is h into a plus b now our objective was to take out the area of a single trapezium so what will we do that area of the parallelogram gets divided by 2 so the formula for area of a trapezium is half h into sum of the parallel sides let's see one more way to derive the formula okay so in this case we divide our trapezium into two triangles in both these triangles we observe that the height remains h either it's the red triangle or the blue triangle the height of both these triangles is h so what can we do we can take out the individual areas of these triangles and add them up so let's see how this works the area of the blue triangle is half base into height so base of the blue triangle is a so the formula is half ah area of the red triangle is again half base into height base in this case is b so the area is half bh let's add both these areas to get the area of the trapezium so we add half ah plus half bh we take half h common and we get a plus b in the brackets so again the formula that we have derived is half h into sum of parallel sides 